Hello and welcome back to a Pilot's Life V2 and today I'm going to show you how to create a custom route that you can fly. Now at the moment here I'm flying for JetBlue in North America and, uh, and I'm really enjoying flying for them but I'm thinking I'd like to actually just do the odd flight somewhere else in the world but still keep my current schedule with JetBlue. Uh, and so I'm thinking I want to fly from Wellington in New Zealand up to Auckland and do an Air New Zealand flight. So how do I do that? It's really, really easy. All you need to do is come across to the shop, click on that, and then down the bottom here you've got flight tickets. So click on that right there. And it's as simple as filling in the two airports that you want to fly to and from. So NZWN. Wellington in New Zealand to NZAA which is Auckland in New Zealand. Now you can put an air co airline code in here if you want to. You don't have to. I'm going to. I'm going to put ANZ and then you go ahead and press search and it's going to bring up all Air New Zealand flights between these two cities. As you can see there are quite a few and it's in the Airbus A320. So exactly what I'm looking to do. Um, what you will notice is there is a price and so in order to do this you, it does actually cost you money uh, and so depending on the length of the flight and a few other things it's going to generate a price. This one here is $64.75. I'll go ahead and add that. Nice and easy ANZ402 NZWN to NZAA and then what you can do is you can either check or uncheck this box down here which says prioritize trip and current schedule and so obviously if you've still got flights to complete in your current schedule uh, if you tick this box it's going to put it right at the top so that means this will be your next flight or you can add it if you don't tick the box it's just going to go on at the end of your schedule so then you go ahead and press purchase and away you go so a couple of things you need to know about flying these custom flights or using flight tickets uh, the first thing is obviously you've seen that you, it does cost money uh, to actually buy them. Uh, the second thing is, is when you fly them you don't earn any pay. Because you're flying for a completely different airline you don't earn any pay. Uh, you do it for free. Uh, but you will earn XP which obviously contributes to your next rank. Um, and uh, so that is quite good that that happens. So there you go ladies and gentlemen. A very quick tutorial but a cool little feature here in its pilot's life. So if you did enjoy the video please go ahead and smash that like button. Subscribe if you're new and until next time everybody take it easy.